stage here, but unbeaten, 14-0 and with 12 knockouts. He is the disruptor himself, Rolando Roli Romero. Pay-per-view headliner just 15 fights into his pro career, hair's, but Roli, right good. off the top, friend. <laughs> the face-off, the push, what the heck happened up there? The motherfucker pushed me. <laughs> <laughs> he fucking scared. He's a frail fucking, I'm a fucking alpha compared to him. He, 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 he a bitch, man. He a bitch for that, man. I could have fucked up the fight, man. With twisting an ankle or some shit, the fight's over, no? How'd you land? On your feet? Everything good? Oh, man, I got some crazy ass replays. Like, boom, boom. Man, and, oh, and then the thing, I go, swim, he go run behind somebody. He's scared, man. He's scared, man. You see that mushy in his eyes? He's scared, scared. You see, Raul, I can't figure him out. Me neither. Is he Me crazy? Neither. Me neither. Crazy like but I love God. it. I love it. Roly, Roly, can you tell our audience how, how serious, bro, how serious are you about knocking Tank out in one round? Can you tell us how that's going to happen and why you're going to do it? Man, I don't know how many times I like said it, man. I'm going <laughs> to knock him out in one round. <laughs> he, he's scared, and he know I'm going to knock him out. He know I'm going to knock him out. He's terrified of me. I've been we I've been watching, I've been watching all the, all the press conference and I've been I've been watching bro. You know is is it some you know something that we don't know? I know a lot that y'all don't know. <laughs> hey, I, you, I, I you, you, you know what's the best information in the world? Yeah. Information I know you don't know. <laughs> well, 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 Stephen, I had him on Morning Combat this week. He revealed the third nipple. I don't know if that's if we can say I, that I out here, that. but uh, third that is, <laughs> he has a lot uh, that nobody else knows. Oh man, uh, but, man uh, it, it's not good luck charm. <laughs> but but it's good luck charm. What, said. Do, what do oh, you know man. about Tank? Is it the history of being around the same gym? What is it, man? Just let's say it like this, man. I, you know, since I've been there with Brent Free in there, you know, I, 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 I've got to explore a little bit of his mind, you know. I know what's in there. I know I know everything about I know all his insecurities. I know everything about him. All right, Stack, you had some inside access to the DMs of one Gervonta Tank Davis. Yeah, so. We saw the receipts today. He says there was no ducking and sparring in 2017, well, I'll show you that shit right now. Shit. Uh oh okay. 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 That's, okay. That's, that, that's what he showed us. He showed us DMs as well. Stack yeah. two sides to every story, to be he fair. Said, he said you said you had to get out of town. No, no, that's some bullshit. <laughs> I live in Vegas. What the fuck you mean? This guy's crazy. Bro, he, he, uh, how would you describe your DS? He, 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 the boy punch drunk. <laughs> The boy punch drunk. Honestly, he shouldn't be fighting. I don't know. Does he pass his fucking cat scan and shit? <laughs> <laughs> Look, meet me at your gym ASAP. He, you said today at 12, right? right? Three hours ahead. So not, so right here is nine. I mean, at six, right? I'm like, you said today at 12. I worked out already, right? So meet tomorrow at one. No, I'm leaving. Meet me. I'm like, you rich, right? Stay another day. He's like, you a hoe, all this bullshit, you know, and, and all this stuff, right? I'm like, tomorrow at one, right? Yeah, fam, you're scared, right? I was like, what's the gym? He's like, what's the gym manager? What, you can't remember? You punch you, you Same one you've been training at. Say less. And what, okay, well, that right? settles it, okay? okay that settles oh, okay. it. There so, so, it okay. So, so he showed up. Uh, so, so he's like, where are you at? Look at the time. Come back over here. Look at the yeah. time. <laughs> Look at the time. Zoom back in. Oh, it's really oh, 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 so, so, the, it, so it's Vegas time, right? So it's three. I'm oh, like, bro, you two hours goodness. late. What yeah. the fuck? To so I fair, worked out again. We didn't he's see fucking... the timestamps on, on Ex tank. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. He ain't show up. All right, well. He ain't show up. He's scared well, of me. Hey, well, y'all get, get to fight for real tomorrow. Damn all the sparring. That's if he don't give a fuck, uh, you, know, you know, maybe his stomach might hurt, you know. You know, he's on his <laughs> ventral cycle and shit, you know. Bro, I got to go. No comment on that. I got to ask <laughs> you about this, though. Is, look, the stage is brighter at this level, but you either look like nothing phases you or maybe you don't know you're supposed to be nervous here, but how are you dealing with the, the, the throngs of people, the stress, the media obligations, everything that comes with this level? Hey, everybody in this damn place love me. Shit. I think they love me too, shit. They better love me, shit. I'm making them all that money. You, def you hey, definitely selling He spot. broke. You definitely selling He spot. broke. Shit. I don't know what I'm making all the money for everybody. Rolly, shit. Rolly, so far, like, you've been doing interviews, the camera's on you, or the whole shebang, right? How's it going to be tomorrow when you walk into the Barclays Center and it's sold out, all the stars, the lights? There's going to be have a little smell been, in the yeah, air, too. Have you ever Stack been in that yeah. kind of environment? What do you feel? Good. I don't know. It feels good, bro. All right. I don't know. I don't pay attention to that shit. I just go in there and go beat the fuck out of whoever's in front of me. <laughs> <laughs> Roly, uh, what, what, what are you going to do with this win? I know you're a confident guy. KO1, first punch that lands. But, like, you knock out Javante Davis on Showtime pay-per-view. 
You're getting different phone calls the next morning, okay? The DMs are going to look a little different. No, 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 no. I am not picking up my phone for anybody. I, I'm going to go on vacation. I, stuff. Ain't, I ain't talking to nobody for a fucking week. Y'all can hit me up after that. <laughs> hey, listen, Roly, you're, it is Cubano, right? You're Cuban, right? Me va Cubano, claro. Cubano. Something you want to say to your all your Latino fans in Spanish? With, you know, you, hey, say eh, in Spanish. Eh, eh, esto, lo, esto lo estoy haciendo para la raza. Así mismo. There we la go. He's la doing raza. it for la raza. La you know, la raza. Do you translate that, like that or do we have He's to... doing it for his people, man. He's doing la it for his people. La raza. Uh, we talk about, uh, to, in closing here, we talk about the toughness, West Baltimore, that makes Gervonta who he is. What was your Las Vegas upbringing like that prepared you for, for who you are, this profession? L let's say it like this. Baltimore right now is ranked number four most dangerous city in the country as far as murders and stuff. Vegas is ranked number three. That says it all. And I'm from the worst part of Vegas. So, yeah, I'm over there from well, around, well, right, right there around Palo Verde, you know. Well, it's, uh, Swanson and Twain, where well, well, it used to be called Swanson and Twain. They changed the name. And uh, my, po my pops lived over there in downtown Vegas. And my mom lived over there in Swanson and Twain. So, yeah, I'm from a pretty fucked up part. I mean, the most dangerous building in Vegas, the most dangerous apartment complex, literally right there on fucking Swenson and Twain. Mm -hmm. Damn. And that's where the most murders happened last year. Well, the best thing about that is both of y'all from them areas and both of y'all here fighting, making great money for boxing and, and changing y'all family's lives. I think it's a good point. But for both I, I don't know about him, but my family doing it. My, I'm making sure my family good. Hey, I saw your dad on All Access. <laughs> your dad is a star in the making, okay? Rolando Sr., is that his name? Yeah, Rolando Sr. He, he's a fiery dude, right? Yeah, but he's a little explosive, man. He kind of scares me. <laughs> he's, he's, the, he's the only one that uh, pisses me off that I can't swing on. <laughs> uh, the, the, the new reality show starring me and Roly is in the works, in production at there this moment. Go. But uh, Roly Romero, thanks for your time. Uh, best of luck to you, luck, obviously. Jim. Saturday night, 9 p.m. Eastern, Showtime pay-per-view. What's your final message, final statement to the fans, to Gervonta? What are we going to see in the ring tomorrow Hey, night? man, I ain't got to say I said it a million times, man. Just buy the pay-per-view. Y'all going to see, man. I'm starting to fucking make And you see this shit. I'm number one ranked pound-for-pound -pound fighter in the world. And y'all see Saturday night. The pound-for-pound -pound king. He said it. He's pound right for here. Pound. Wow. <laughs> Thank you so much, Roly. Best of luck Come to on, you. Bro. What's up? You want to order that pay-per-view that Roly's talking about? Show.com.